All right, guys, I um, wanted to do, um, we have a lot of people that are in their VIP, um, or you may have new promoters that are in their VIP bonus. So I wanted to um, go live since we do have a packed VIP report right now and cover some of the basics on keeping things simple for you guys and how to keep it simple for your promoters when you're bringing them in. Um, mainly with a VIP bonus. I think that a lot of people um, overthink it. And in the past, it used to be, I find, um, a lot simpler for people to hit. And I think that people are overcomplicating the fact that it's only for people that you want to thrive with you. Um, so when I first began, um, so what loud. I did was... Um, My earpiece is like really loud. I made a list. Um, I know that... Um, Jennifer and Holly had suggested that I make a list for my VIP report based on the people that I wanted to connect with, um, you know, on getting started. We've got a couple more people added, so we'll get everybody in here. Um, here we go. So the VIP, um, basically, I started with a list, um, and that way it wasn't overcomplicating. I think everyone either thinks they don't know anybody or they're overcomplicating it and then just, just doesn't, don't share it all and just clam up and aren't sure what to do um, or who to approach. So when I began, um, you know, Jennifer, um, and we kind of trained on it actually probably for my first five years um, was on your list um, of making a list of the people that you want to connect with for your VIP bonus. Um, the first people instantly are going to be the people that you love and trust. You're going to make it into four columns. Um, your first column is going to be, like I said, the people you love and trust. They're going to be the ones that you go to right away. It's going to be your best friend. Um, it's going to be your mom. Um, it's going to be maybe if you were in another organization with someone and you know that they'd be a perfect fit and they're, you know, like your, your business partner, like, Hey, we're doing this together. I love and trust you. Let's these, you know, I, ju I just joined this company called Lavelle. I found this amazing product called Thrive and this is what it's done for me. Um, and sometimes, you know, it, I know one of my girlfriends was like, well, just what are we doing? Tell me what I'm doing. I trust you. I love you. What are we doing? Where do I sign up? Um, you know, and it's always fun to do it together. I always say that it's fun to do it together. So that first column is going to be a list of people that you just love and trust. They're going to be the first ones that you want to reach out to. Um, the next one is going to be people that really need this product. Um, they're going to be um, a list of people that you're going to continually add to as time goes on, as you see, okay, someone's posting about headaches, someone's posting all of their monster energy drinks, someone's posting that their kids are sucking the life out of them, um, back aches, um, I'm trying to lose weight, um, or someone that you know um, has tried a lot of products before, maybe they you know, I know a lot of people that have joined our, our business have tried everything. You hear, I've tried everything. I've done everything in the past. Well, do you know someone that's always willing to try those things because they just want to feel better? We all know what Thrive can do. Those are going to be the people that you want to reach out to, um, you know, or um, you don't always have to just go reach out to them right away. If they're commenting, like spam, you know, the shit out of them because you know, they have constant headaches they can be someone that you specifically interact with on those posts. Um, or if they're complaining one time, maybe instant message, just say, you know, um, I'm not overstepping in any way. I know that you constantly post about headaches. That's a huge benefit to thrive um, that it can really help with. Um, if you're open-minded, you know, I'll, I'll send a sample to your way, a, a sample your way. If not, it's totally okay. Um, but I just thought of you and wanted to reach out. Um, so you don't always have to go with like the, hey girl, I know you need some Thrive because you're posting headaches or comment your link on their, you know, their post. There's a way to just have a natural approach to things without being spammy. But we all would love to just shove it down everyone's throats if we could. We literally would just want to package Aaron. Aaron's like, that's me. Um, <laughs> it is. You would want, I would want to just package this up and ship it to people and then be at their house in the morning. And I'm like, okay, here's your capsules. You're going to take this. You're going to do this. Um, 
but it, it's not going to work that way. You have to make them think that it's their idea, that they need it for all of these things that are wrong. So you just have to continue to present it to them and you have to make sure that you're interacting with them. Um, so if your stories are full of Thrive or you're sharing the Lavelle Thrive experiences, that list of people um, are going to get exposed to that, you know. And then the next column is going to be the people that could use this business. Who is, uh, you know, a lot of times it's, you know, is it a sports mom? Because sports are expensive for their kids. They need that extra money. Someone posting about looking for a second job. Someone who is sick of their second job. Um, I know a lot of people were waitresses at night or bartenders for extra jobs. were able to eliminate those kind of things um, from the equation when they started thriving. Or they had multiple, you know, multiple random jobs that they were able to fizzle out. Um, so the business opportunity, um, you have to think about when maybe you have a customer that's constantly just sharing or she loved Thrive and is like, I can't afford it. Um, you know, you can put that into perspective what the business is. Those are the people that you want to reach out. Or do you know someone that maybe was in direct sales years ago? Um, you know, I did Premiere for a while years ago. Premiere's closed. Jewelry parties are like a thing of the past. Um, the jewelry's fun. I still buy from online parties, but it's just not the thing like um, some of the other businesses are. So um, you could reach out to people maybe you were in an old company with, um, or you could just continue to present the business and interact with them, but have them on your list. Um, the next one would be your chicken list is your fourth column, guys. Um, and that's kind of someone that you know would just be a rock star with the business. You're too scared to reach out to, but you have them on their li your list and they're always in your mind. I still have my whole list that I wrote when I started of all of these people that I wanted to reach out to because sometimes it's just a time and place um, when you want to approach someone about the business or have that conversation or, um, you know what I mean? Maybe someone just lost a family member. You're like, you know what? This is not the time or place to be like, you need chill. I know it would help you. Like your family died, like you're soliciting something. Keep those people in mind down the road and just say, hey, you know what? I thought of you. I know you, you know, I know what has been going on in your life. I really think this could help you. Um, make that list um, of people that you're just scared to reach out to, but at some point you're going to. Um, and have that in mind. So as a newest promoter is getting started, I know that we have in, in Team Believe, we have Maria's VIP bot. It's an interactive bot that basically will respond to you through Messenger. Um, and one of the things on there as you're a new promoter getting started is the memory jogger. Um, there's so many people with that memory jogger that it will trigger. Um, you know, you, it could just be like, hey, the letter A, or who'd you go to high school with? Or who are your fa favorite hairstylists? Um, let me add them on Facebook. Or, you know, who were all of the other sports moms? Um, different people in categories of maybe people you want to connect with um, that maybe you've lost connection with um, as, as time goes on. So those connections are nice. Um, so a memory jogger definitely um, can help. I mean, you can Google memory joggers um, if you don't, you don't, you don't even have to pull up um, Maria's, you know, Maria's bot. Um, it's just a matter of giving you a platform of where to go, but doing it in a simple way, not overcomplicating anything, just knowing who are you going to reach out to as a new promoter or as a sponsor telling your promoters, hey, you know what? Keep these people in mind as you're reaching out. But in the end, it's only four. That's all they need. Two of those people want to just be customers and thrive with them. Two of those people want to thrive with them, but they're willing to take a chance on a business or they're willing to order a promoter pack um, just to help you out so you can get that $800 in orders. Um, and then when you get that bonus check of that $400, $100 in credits and that commission, um, my best suggestion for any new promoter is if you blow that whole check, um, you're screwing yourself. You need to reinvest at least a small portion of that or set that aside for maybe when there's a promotion down the road and utilize some of those credits to help the new people you're bringing in. Um, and in turn, reinvesting is going to only pay you back dividends. I've continually reinvested in this business um, and taking money and setting it aside at the start is a good habit to do because there's never a promotion that's come up where I'm like, can't take advantage of it, can't do it um, because I'm always planning ahead. So best advice for a new promoter is treat yourself to something nice with that VIP bonus. But remember that um, 
you have new promoters that are in their VIP and what could you do to help them? Um, you know, a small amount goes a long way. Maybe you just got some extra DFTs on an order. Well, you know what? You could share maybe a sample. You could break up a sample and help another, uh, you know, someone with a new customer that's just struggling um, to get a sample out. Anything can help. Um, you don't have to give away like the bank when you're starting a business because people treat free like free. So um, when people have skin in the game and they're spending money on the product, they're willing to treat that like a product, you know, like they've, they've invested in that. Um, they're not going to just toss it to the side. No one's going to spend $400 on a promoter pack and just like, let it sit there. Um, if they're willing to grow their business, they're like, oh, wow, I got to break this up into samples. I got to get these into people's hands. I got to recoup this investment that I made. Um, so it also is, you know, when you have customers and you have, you know, your promoters that you're looking at, um, if you have someone that truly down the road you think might make a good promoter and they're just going to order a promoter pack right now just to help you out, it makes better sense in the long run to not burn someone's VIP bonus. Don't ever just sign your spouse up when you're starting your VIP bonus just to hit a bonus because there may be a time a year down the road that you want your spouse to run for a VIP bonus. Um, and the option's not going to be there. Um, they only have those first 14 days when they sign up with you and when they get started to earn that VIP bonus. So you need to remember some people are just meant to be customers. Some people really want to be promoters. Um, and it's totally okay to have them either way. Um, but you definitely don't want to burn someone's VIP. Um, a lot of times I know when people are starting, they'll say, Hey mom, I'd love you. To, you know, they'll, I need you to be my next promoter to help me out. I want to hit this bonus. Um, you know, unless your mom really would want to be a promoter. Um, we've, we've seen, you know, mom and daughter millionaire duos in Lavelle. So mom and daughter, they do promote. Um, hey, my daughter's going to promote. Um, she'll be old enough to, to set up an account and get started when she's 18. Um, and remember also when you're doing a VIP bonus, they, these have to be 18 and older. Um, you can't just sign up like your newborn baby um, to be your auto ship customer. These have to be, um, you know, someone that is, you know, 18 and older. Um, but um, really, like I said, it's just about keeping it simple, but making a list and knowing where to go um, is important. Um, whether it's just your 10 coworkers or however you want to, making a list will really simplify things so you don't overwhelm yourself and then just do nothing for this VIP bonus. So as you're bringing in, like I said, new promoters, or if you are the new promoter, this is definitely a great platform to, to step forward with. Just something simple um, and not overcomplicating that. And in our team page, I'm going to go ahead here and, and share my screen. Um, so we have, there we go. All right. So I have my team page here for you guys. So you can see, I know, um, some of you guys are under, um, Holly and Jennifer and Courtney. Um, I know that Jennifer has some of this and we are successful. So you guys are familiar with that as well. Um, let me pop this up here. Here we go. Okay. So in the guides that will be on um, team pages, one of the guides that are here, um, you know, and, and honestly, if you want extra training, there's so many great things that are in here. The couples panels, um, this is how couples work their business. If you have someone who has a spouse that's not on board, um, this is great to hear from couples um, on how they work it together. Um, and maybe I, I want to say that one of the panelists, you know, it just took a little time, you know, to know what to do. So um, there's a yin and yang with, um, with couples. So like I said, this is a great one. There's so many different things from this training that we had um, that you can watch that are all the recordings from our Toledo training that you have access to social media and branding. There's so many freaking awesome tips guys, um, from leaders on our team, um, events and gatherings. Like if you're hosting events, like I know Jess, Jess and Sydney and Haas, like crush events, they are on here. Um, the VIP 1600, um, and the five, four, three, two, one, um, which we we've done a bunch of trainings on that. The Facebook pages that we use to grow our business. When you're new and you're bringing someone on board, um, you want to make sure that you're connecting maybe a new customer when you don't have the answers, adding them to the customer page 
and saying, hey, I tagged you in this or, or asking them first, add tag and message. I always ask everyone, hey, do you mind if I add you into the small group that I have um, for some of my team and my network and just people who are trying to feel out thrive or people thriving with me? Um, I'm going to tag you in some things so you have some, uh, you know, a good jumping point. Um, add them in there. Um, let that page do the work for you because there's so much great validation. You'll find that people are going to snoop on their own. And this is a great resource by adding them into the happy and healthy page, um, or whatever customer page your team uses, or if you just use Maria's customer page, um, that she has for all of us, you can do that as well. Um, but here's new promoter breakdowns. Um, your, you know, your VIP, um, 1600, um, the breakdown from the cloud office on um, how do I get paid? What's that VIP bonus do? So all of this is is in here. Um, here's an old right, new promoter 101 that I have in here. But this is your breakdown on know, how you said, get paid from the VIP bonus. Um, what's nice as well, guys, um, is these are literally just at your fingertips. So if you've not watched them, um, you know, tag your teams in them. I know that this is Dawn's favorite video. What's your vision and goals? She tags every single new promoter in this when they watch because it's Brittany Williams testimony from our Vegas getaway where she was a house cleaner. She was cleaning someone's house and saw their vision board um, and asked them about it. And her and her husband are dual millionaires now. I mean, it's like a Cinderella story and it's a great testimony um, you know, that anything is possible in this business. Um, and it's a good reminder when you watch it too, like not to be discouraged because anything is possible. Um, we've got a lot of different Instagram trainings, attraction marketing. If you go that route, how to grow your network on social media. These are just some, um, probably about two years ago, we did like a, the seven video series. We had everybody train on and watch these seven videos. Um, and we kind of base things off of that for ideas to post, how to use your stories through social media, building a story brand. Um, you don't have to overcomplicate yourself with, oh my gosh, who am I? How am I presenting myself what, as a new promoter? At this point, just be you and share what the product is doing. Don't overthink that you have to come in as a brand new promoter and you hear you know, some great trainings on what are your five things? Um, in time, those five things are five things about you that you really focus on and hone in that make you relatable to other people. Um, you know, um, I'm just giving you an example because I know you guys hear a lot about the five things um, on different trainings. Um, you know, I've always been a soccer mom. I'm still a soccer mom, even though my son is in college. Um, connecting with other soccer moms or hashtags with soccer moms. Or, um, you know, if you're in a soccer mom group or I'm in a Kent State parents group. Um, so I interact and connect to that. Now I'm a Kent State parent. Um, these are ways based on things about you that you can connect with other people to build relationships. Um, and, you know, you might be in a group because you have maybe a health condition or you have a hobby of hiking. I'm also in a national parks group because I live in a national park. Um, so those are options as well, too. Um, let me see here if I can get this. Sorry. Okay. Um, so there's a lot of these things on here. Um, but what you want to do is be you, share the product, and don't be spammy. Don't post pictures of just the one, two, three, and say, um, your friends don't know what that is. They don't know what the three steps are. They need to see a picture of you with that patch or a picture of you holding those packages and opening them. If you're confident enough to go live and share, you know, going live, um, you know, every now and then is going to get people exposed to you. Um, you have to build that confidence, but you don't have to just put random pictures of products all the time that your friends, your friends don't have a clue what those three steps are. They're just boxes of vitamins to them. They don't know that they're magical nutrition that could absolutely change their life. You need to put, paint that picture for them of what it's doing for you. Um, whether it's just with a small post, um, you know, sharing, you know, how, how you're feeling your day one, day three, day 10, um, share what it's doing and do it in a genuine way. Like, um, if you're someone that's always suffered from headaches and you're getting relief, post about those headaches. If you, you know, are, are losing weight, you know, I have one of my new customers, she's been on auto ship and she, um, I think it's six weeks. Not, or not even six weeks. This is her second auto ship that's going out. She's down 19 pounds. Um, you know what I mean? So 
that's someone that I would love to be a customer, but those are the things that you want to share. If you're losing weight, um, some people, if you're starting with a detox, sharing what the detox is doing, it's honestly just about letting people know what it's doing for you and consistently doing that. Um, don't post five times a day. Um, and, and, you know, you want to sprinkle in your thrive with part of your life or showing how Thrive is impacting how your life is going right now. Maybe you've not been able, you know, I, I know in the past some, we've had some, some stories where I've had some customers um, that were able to ride a roller coaster. I actually had promoters um, that was able to ride a roller coaster oh, because they couldn't fit in the seat. Um, those were life-changing moments. Um, how is it impacting your life? Are you more present with your family? Um, are you sleeping better at night? Are you better at your job because you have more patience and more focus um how it's incorporated into your life and sharing that it's just being genuine you don't have to have a full script on every ingredient and have every answer you just have to tell people to trust you and get thrive into their hands those promoter packs that come with those samples are gold. The fact that you can share that with people before you even get your kit in your hands, you can start mailing those three-day samples out. They do so much more than the, the post will bring them in, but the product is going to seal the deal. Um, personally, let me, oh, we have something in our chat. Oh, can you mute everyone? Is everyone muted? Let me Sorry, guys, let me see here if I can mute everybody from this option. Let's see if we can go. Who's not muted? Mute. Sorry, guys, bear with me. I didn't realize. I have my volume down. <laughs> All right, here, let me. Where am I not seeing everybody? Stop share for a second. Sorry, guys. Where did it go? You guys, I'm trying to get this uh, my screen here. Why is this frozen over here? So All right, well, I don't know why it's not, it's not muting. There we go. The side, the thing on the side was not popping up for me. Sorry, guys. All right, we got it. Sorry, I don't know why it wasn't muting. My volume was turned down. I didn't realize Skylar's been using this, um, Skylar's been using this computer. So the volume is always, already, <laughs> always down. All right, so let's go back just to um, screen share here. Sorry, guys, I didn't even realize. All right, here we go. There we go. All right, hopefully that wasn't going on forever because I literally did not even realize it or see that. All right, here we go. Okay. Um, we've got our income producing activities um, files on here. There's a deep dive training. I cover IPAs on that um, when they did the documentary at my house. Um, there's um, this great document that John did on IPAs that are gonna cover your daily income producing activities. If you sit down 
um, and are looking for things that are going to be productive for your business, this is a super easy checklist to just run down. I'm not going to cover all of these guys, but this is just a great resource if you need to keep things simple and you want just a checklist of things that you need to do. Um, this is very, very easy to just click on and use this. Um, I have it printed up. Um, so honestly, it's it's a great, great, great resource here. Let me move this. All right, and we've got all the way at the bottom, it's gonna be the app called Boards. Um, we've done, there's, there's just a quick video. I'm not gonna go into huge detail on this, but on this Boards app that you can download, I have in the guide um, is a training that Jess Green did. It's a screen share showing you how to set this up. But what it's got on here um, are some scripts for how to make posts. And there's going to be your first 14 days in there of ideas of things that you can post, what you can say. There's going to be the video links to all of the products that you can share. Um, so download that. If you are not sure at all how to access this boards app, scroll down where you see this here and you can click on this and it's going to give you just a quick YouTube video that she did of training and it will make more sense to you guys. Um, so the simplicity of that. Um, in our team page as well, um, let me go here to Team Believe. Um, you're going to have access as you're a new promoter and getting started to so much information. Like I said, those guides are in there for you to, to, to look up, run through with trainings, anything that you can possibly think of, um, you'll have access to in there. Um, you can search the team page as well. Um, there's this hourglass. If you've got a topic that you want to know something about, um, you know, maybe you have someone that has a question um, and they're, um, they're on, you know, let's say thyroid medication. Just search the word thyroid and you'll get any post. If it's in the, in the team page, these are some of them, you know, you can't really make medical claims, but if people are asking questions, there's suggestions for what thyroid, you know, people can take. Um, this is not a page that your, your customers have access to, but it's a way you can get a resource and get an answer. Most medical claims or medical questions, just send them to their doctor is pretty simple. Um, the last thing that I really wanted to cover with you guys for your newest promoters is, is really um, besides, um, you know, utilizing Facebook, utilizing the fan page um, is just understanding your website. Um, we won't go into huge detail on the website, but I, um, I want to make sure that you know where to go to get the answers as a new promoter. Um, you've got on here the brand, the founders, cloud technology. This is something that I always talk about our business. This was something that attracted me to the company was the cloud technology. Um, because I, I actually remember my old company buying another building. Um, and I'm thinking back to all of the money and the things that were in those equations that we don't have. And it's genius that we don't have a corporate office, a brick and mortar building, all of those expenses are gone and it goes back into our product. So we're kind of like the Amazon of supplements. So it's very, um, to me, genius. This is where you're going to get the links and learn all about the Thrive experience or send your customers, um, you know, those links. Anytime you do a link, guys, Thrive, that's going to take you directly there. If you have a Thrive Plus line um, product and your customer wants to know about it, on that Boards app is going to give you a direct video. But if you want them to see it directly on your website, click on Detox and then highlight that right there. This will take them, um, I'm not sure why it's saying restricted, it could be this laptop, uh, copy it and send it over. Um, you'll have access to that direct link for your customers. Um, so when they want to order that product, they're already on your website, Thirst. Um, Thirst is gonna be right there. Copy, I, you know, I get people to ask me a lot about it because I post about it, because um, it's a, one of our top favorite products. Send that hyperlink directly to them. They can watch the video, but they're directly on your website when you send it to them, um, having that in front of it. So it definitely, that is very helpful as well that you may not be aware of just these simple things that can save you some time. Um, achievements. These are amazing accomplishments with the company. LV rewards. Um, this is if someone wants to get started as a promoter, make this your link. 
copy that link. You can actually take that as your link when you put it in your Instagram stories. Um, it's a lot to type out, but if you put it in your stories, your link will carry over and it will take someone to getting started um, and on your website. Um, so they're going to have access to just what it is. It's a, it's free to be a promoter. Um, how do you get qualified and active as a promoter? Um, those are different, um, you know, links that you can send LV life. Are you even aware of anything? The I am 200 K documentaries, the blog, there's official blog with great information. These can be things that you share on your Facebook page, um, that are great information, um, or ways that you learn about the business do's and don'ts of thrive. Um, there's how to be a morning person, kickstart your new year, um, four ways for a tired nurse to stay energized through a nursing shift. Do you know a nurse that's your customer? Send them this. Um, it's a great resource. There's so many different things in here. Um, what people are saying, um, you know, there's so much about us in the news um, in here that you can click on. Um, anytime we have like a new update, um, there's going to be different things, um, you know, customers, Thrive Experience stories. You can share right from there. Also, you know, obviously the YouTube channel. Um, Thrivers TV has got some great resources that you can learn from. Thriver season one, there's real Thrive Experiences, the documentaries, the deep dive sessions. Um, you know, these actually were awesome. Um, Starla Scrivener is the bomb. Talia Roeder is the bomb. Um, Megan Shaughnessy, I love them. And they're all of these were so different. I had one as well. Um, all of ours were different approaches to the business and what you do on a daily basis to achieve goals. You want to follow successful people. You're maybe you're going to pick up something from watching what Starla does that I've never told you, um, that your uplines never told you. Um, and the company is not going to pick someone that's going to be sharing like crap with you. Um, these are people that have hit certain ranks um, and are in the game. So, you know, like I said, these are great resources if maybe you need a different spin on something um, and you just maybe need a fresh perspective. Um, I've learned so much from plugging myself personally um, into so many different trainings from other leaders that the company has. The company's got a VIP promoter training tomorrow night. I'm always learning and willing to be open-minded. Um, there's still so many things I've yet to learn and, and do, but know all of this is available on your personal website that you have access to, um, you know, and how to do it. So don't overcomplicate that you have to know all of this right away. Use these resources as your third party validation and and grow from it, um, as well as guys on on the Lavelle fan page. If you haven't already, make sure that you like the Lavelle brands fan page. I also have um, our CEOs, Paul and Jason, set um, to view first. So I'm always going to get notifications. I'm always going to get information on all of them first. Um, when I'm following them, but sharing stories are, are an incredible way to grow your business, copying graphics that they share all over the place on here. There's photos. You can utilize those photos guys. Um, but sharing these stories or what I like to do is I actually have, um, an album on my personal Facebook page, um, that I'll show you guys here. Um, I'm not a public figure. There we go. You can create an album um, and just continue to add to it over time. Um, I have one um, under my photos. Um, see all photos. Albums. My albums, um, Why I Thrive. So I'll add stories from time to time to this album. And then when someone can click on that album because they've seen the story that I just shared, they're gonna see all of these and they can read through these. Um, so it's really important to share those stories. You know what I'll do, um, I think this was one I shared. I mean, and I had so many people that have commented. Um, I Now maybe I wonder if it was her, it was earlier this, this lady who had, oh, um, maybe this was it. 
oh yeah, she had two sets of twins. I was like, let's share the shit out of this. Like, this is incredible what it's done. Um, you know, so I actually got a lot of customers from sharing this story and I just wrote myself, I'll never get sick of sharing stories like this. Yours, yours, um, is waiting is just waiting to be written. And then I copied the story and I paste it from the fan page and put it in quotes. So it's not me. And I add that to the album. So it's constantly going and going and going guys. Um, but these stories, um, they come from the Lavelle fan page. You don't want to copy and share from any like random place. These are not medical claims. They're not financial claims. Um, these are stories. So you want to make sure, you know, okay. So you have liked the page. Um, have you invited all of your friends to like the page? Um, you can go in and you can invite everyone, um, to like this page, share it. Um, obviously we have a YouTube channel. You can watch the video about the products and it will take you directly there. Um, on here I have, um, you know, you can see the events, you can see all of the videos. It's just great information. And this is an amazing, amazing resource to have at your fingertips with your business. Um, let me go back here. There we go. All right. Does anybody have any questions, guys? I just wanted this to really just be a simple way of where you get the information to get Thrive Out to and not to overcomplicate things. And the list to kind of start off with, it's 14 days as a new promoter and it's just four people. And then when you have those two promoters, you want to help them earn their VIP. And it's just a chain reaction. They've always called the VIP bonus, the lifeblood of this business. When someone gets that first belief check, they believe in, in the company. They believe in you for bringing them into this. And they believe in themselves that anything is really possible. Um, and if someone doesn't hit their VIP, the world isn't going to end because life happens and people don't hit it. And it's totally okay. Um, is there a way to add more... Is there a way to add more info to the boards? No, you can create your own board um, of the information that you want and create one that has the topics that you want, but you can't add to a board that somebody already has set up. Um, I know I set up a separate one that has, for my team, I think I shared, that has um, the business videos that I share. I have one, Why Thrive, Why Lavelle, Why Now? It's a great presentation that I did. And I also have one that Haas and I did together because I like it from a male, female perspective. Um, and we both did a really good job. It was like a Thrive After Five, like Wednesday night event. Um, and I have it on the YouTube channel. So I use those um, as a great one. And then I, I think I have just another one of myself um, that I've used. But if there's great videos that you like from the YouTube channel um, that you've seen from the business presentation, you can definitely create and add anything that you want into that. Um, guys, if you're a new promoter and you're on this Zoom, like posting pictures of, hey, I'm building my business online, um, community, thriving with other people, sharing this on your stories. Those are great things that we have. Um, but I just don't want anyone to get overwhelmed, or if you're trying to reboot your business or something new has come into your life, um, you just have to remember to just slow it down and keep it simple and really focus on putting you out there and what the product's doing. If you're not sharing and you're keeping it to yourself, they're going to go and order from the person who's sharing and being consistent and in the game. Um, I'm getting more people about the detox because I'm consistently, you know, last time I did it, I posted all, you know, almost every 10 days. My story's full of the detox right now because that's what I'm doing. I'm consistently doing it or I'm sharing the Thrive experience. Um, my life is the 10 day detox. So that's what you're going to see right now. So share what you're doing, put it out there. Um, and if you have people that have questions as a new promoter, that's what your upline is for. Um, you know, you connect them with someone to validate until you have all of the answers. And even when you think you have all the answers, you don't. Um, I still go to my upline for help and assistance when I need things or to bounce things off. Um, no one is ever, no one ever knows everything. Um, so as you're starting, um, don't ever say, I'm sorry to bug you. I'm sorry I'm asking a million questions to your upline because the people that don't ask the questions don't get the right answers, give the wrong information or lose a customer because they didn't take the time to ask. The people who ask me a million questions and are 
inboxing me, texting me and calling me nonstop. Aaron's put a big smile on her face. Um, those are the people that I want on my team. Cause you are eager, you're hungry. You want to know the right information. You want to grow your business. So don't ever apologize for bugging someone a ton. That's what your upline is there for. Um, no one comes into this business knowing everything. So utilize your upline and utilize your, you know, your sponsor and you in turn, when you're learning those things, those are going to be things that you can pass down to your team as you're training them and as you're growing, because you learn them from your upline um, and have fun in the end, guys. It's all about having fun, making people feel better because you feel better. If you're out having fun because you're thriving and living life, you want other people to do that too. Um, so share your thrive life and thrive out loud. Do not keep this a secret. Do not hide it from anyone. Um, there's nothing to be ashamed of um, for living your best life um, and wanting others to do it too. Um, so don't overcomplicate it with all of the mechanics of things that will, they will all come along in time. Um, so I think that's about it. Um, I also wanted to just remind you guys, I posted in Team Believe and I posted in some of the chats as well and others can share in their chats. Um, tomorrow night, the corporate, um, Liz Ruth is, hand, is uh, hosting a VIP fast start training call with four leaders. Um, the one girl, Mallory, I actually, I, she was in my group when we did, um, it was um, a leadership group. We were in Vegas and we did a... Um, was a scavenger hunt. Um, and I follow her on Facebook. She's great. Um, so I'm really excited to see her on there because I see how she is on her Facebook and the way she's growing her business. So it's going to be a great group tomorrow night to learn from. So I'm excited to learn some new things. That's going to be at eight o'clock Eastern standard time on Tuesday and Thursday, Aaron and I are doing, um, the work with me is, um, they're side by side for success zooms, half hour of income producing activities. If you're new, these are going to be very simple ways to grow your business. We're going to show you what to do. So you basically just aren't scrolling Facebook and wasting time. We're going to show you the tools, um, and the actions to take to grow your business income producing activities. Um, it's every Tuesday and Thursday. Um, and then Tuesday night is the corporate Zoom. Every Tuesday, the company has testimonies hosted by a 200K and some of their team sharing powerful testimonies of what the Thrive Experience can do. So you want to invite people. Um, I'm hosting. We've got Jody Lindemuth. We've got um, Luke um, is on here. We've got Christina Lane sharing. All of our experiences are different, but if you've got people that are going to be your newest customers, Hearing other people's stories, sometimes when it's, when you're really um, wanting to change someone's life, um, maybe your story, you don't feel as impactful. Um, not that it's not, but connecting them, sometimes people will, will trust a third party before they trust you. So invite them to that Zoom Tuesday night, nine o'clock Eastern time. And then um, stay tuned for a live updates from Punta Cana. Um, we'll be there. Um, a lot of people are getting in early. We get in um, Thursday. The party is Friday night. New products are dropping. I'm imagining other things will be launching. Um, so we have a busy week to help you finish February strong or finish your VIP strong or whatever it is that you're doing. Um, so all of that's lined up. We can get those Zooms to you if you guys don't have the links. Um, oh, you're welcome. Oh, I love you, Katrina. She's so cute. Um, and I think that's about it. So I will get the recording out for anyone needs this um, and have a good night, you guys. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday night.